our university has been championing uh, sustainability, sustainability issues for the last five years. And we have got a group of about 100 researchers doing uh, and organized under the uh, Sustainability Research Alliance, uh, focusing on three major areas of research. There is one on low carbon uh, societies for Malaysia, uh, which is under Professor Ho. The second is uh, on uh, environmental performance index for uh, research for Malaysia. And third is we are launching this January 2014. Uh, a partnership, five-year partnership between UTM and MIT US on sustainable cities research. Uh, so uh, we are here to organize a site event uh, sharing our findings on low carbon research, which, was, which is, uh, has been headed by Professor Ho. And, and certainly we hope to, to share our findings and, and, and hopefully to form a network of uh, uh, collaborators uh, in this area of uh, research. We came here for the exhibition, trying to showcase what, what the activities that we have done on low carbon, especially in Malaysia and also around Asia. And what we have done here, actually, we, uh, this time we have launched our low carbon, uh, uh, low carbon society blueprint, um, the main text, as well as um, another document uh, on this action plan and a few more other uh, plans that we, we have here. So we as a university, we are working a kind of how do we translate science into policy making. So this is, I think, one of the areas which we find that is unique in, in, in developing countries like Malaysia, whereby uh, most of the kind of policy making uh, really needs scientific input and, and we provide the, the research backing for this kind of, of research. And I think in this event, we uh, participated in three uh, main uh, side events, presenting all our findings that we have done for the last uh, whole year. Yeah. And how can your findings be rolled out to other countries um, in Asia and indeed the world? Um, yeah, I think uh, one of the purpose of this Low Carbon Asia Center is to function as a COE, Center of Excellence. Yeah whereby uh, we hope that the methodology, the best practices that we have done in Malaysia could, could uh, kind of uh, uh, use in other ASEAN countries so that they probably could able to cut down uh, carbon emission like what we are going through now. Yeah. And how could you think this could influence the talks here? Uh, do you think it could help boost confidence towards a global deal? Yeah, I think... Uh with uh, the initiatives that we're doing where we are working with uh, the uh, unique partnership between researchers, uh, policy makers and the implementers. Uh, we hope uh, this will uh, uh, something that we, uh, we hope this will inspire people who are doing the talks here to, 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 uh, 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 to really implement uh, actions that can uh, uh, have a big impact on climate change, you know, so because uh, it shows that it is something that is a partnership that is working, you know, uh, and, and not something theoretical or something uh, which cannot be implemented in practice.